it is common that exchange EDB file size increases with time, as mail flow increases between sender and recipients. In the intense working environment, large data is shared among the users for communication and other needs. The real issue starts when the CDB size comes near to threshold point, that is size limit. There is freezing issue which makes functioning impossible, makes data inaccessible, and when this issue grows, it leads to EDB file corruption. So it is mandatory to reduce the EDB file size to avoid the corruption. Try these manual solutions to reduce the EDB file size by deleting unrequired data from EDB. Carefully delete the unwanted exchange database data manually avoiding the important files. This will create a free space though no reduction in file size is visible. But free space is available for further adding any data. Next method is defragging EDB file using EaseUtil application. This method uses inbuilt EaseUtil application of Exchange to compress the database and remove the white space created by deleting any data. It utilizes the commands in Exchange Management shell and frees up the space in EDB file, thus reducing its size. Manual solutions can be performed but not feasible for a long time and include limitations like slow process, high maintenance period, complexity, risk of manual error, etc. Better way is to go for a professional tool, kernel for Exchange Server, that reduces EDB file size within minutes by converting large EDB file into multiple small PST files. Let's see the process. First download the tool from the website and install it in your system location. Run the software and click Offline EDB as option. Offline EDB file is automatically selected as source. Click Next. Click three dots, browse and add your EDB file from the system location. Click Next to continue. Select one of the scanning modes and click Next. A message will be shown that EDB file is successfully added. Click Finish. The EDB file data will get retrieved in a couple of minutes. Now right-click on any EDB mailbox and select Export Mailboxes to PST option from the list. Here, you can select the folders from the mailboxes, apply date range and item type filters, and most important, use Split PST option. Select the checkbox, enter the size, after which PST file should get split. Choose other options if required and provide the destination location at the end. Click Export to start the conversion process. The export will get completed in very less time. A report for export is generated for the users. Hence, you have seen how easy it is to reduce the EDB file size with kernel for Exchange Server tool instead of using the manual ways. To gather more information about this software, visit this link. Thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.